Breaking news. President Buhari has finally agreed with restructuring Governor L5 reports. Governor Nesai Rufai of Cardinal State has said that President Momodu Buhari is not opposed to state police and true federalism. El Rufai, who was the chairman of the All Progressive Congress on the true federalism, which submitted its report in 2018, said that President Momodu Buhari is not opposed to restructuring. The governor said that it was the National Assembly that has failed to act on the recommendations to make the laws. Nigeria is the only country in the world that is a federation that has only one police force. We have made the agreements. We have argued that the state should be allowed to have their own police and that even Local governments should be allowed their own police as well, El Rufai says. The president agrees with the content, the main crux of the report and with draft bills that will enable the amendments of the constitution as well as its status recommendations that will give F effects to our recommendations. I call on members of our National Assembly to take our reports to look at the bills we have drafted and look and work on them. Try to give all state police, state judiciary, vest control of oil and minerals in the state, offshore in the government of the federal will state, and the whole state should pay loyalty and task. El Rufai said, as quoted by Vanguard, many individuals and groups have sustained a call for Nigerian to be restructured with the latest call coming from Ifai Okowa, the governor of Delta State. Okowa noted that the country's constitution was a major problem, adding that politicians must stop playing politics with the issues of restructuring. In the same vein, a former chief security officer to late military ruler General Sani Abacha, Azan El Mustafa, at the weekend advised Nigerians not to allow politicians to decide restructuring on the country. He said that such would be dangerous and would break the Nigeria apart, adding that citizens were toying with the issues by allowing the political elite to take the front seat in the agitation for Nigerians' realignments. Thank you, my viewers, for listening to this news. Hmm. This is so, so um, surprising. You can imagine. <laughs> Will Buari agree to this truly? Or is Erifai just saying his own? Is he just saying it because he just wants to talk? Saying President Mori Buari um, accepted the structure. Is that so? Is that true? Should we believe that or not? Should we? Should we believe it or not? We don't know what to believe. We don't even know if truly Buhari um, agrees to this um, this um, part of the structure, or maybe uh, Lufra is just lying and calling for the attention of um, Nigerian citizens. You can imagine that if truly he has, uh, has agreed to the structure in the country, that is a good news. It's a good news, a good news for that. A good news. 
the good news. Okoa is also involved in this. He said Okoa noted that the country's constitution was a major problem, adding that politicians must stop playing politics with the issues of restructuring. If they want to, if truly they want to structure in the country, they should go ahead. They should stop playing with it. Many individuals and groups have also sustained the call for Nigeria to be structured, with the latest call coming from Okoa, the governor of Delta State. That is it, yes. So the president says he agrees with the contents of the report that, that they draft. They drafted that they drafted the bill they drafted that will enable the amend, amendment of the constitution as well as the uh, statutes amendments that will give effect to Nigerian recommendation or the Elufaka recommendation. Nigeria is the only country in the world that is a, ref, a federation and also has only one police force. They have made, because of this, they have argued a lot. They had arguments that the state should be allowed to have their own police and that even uh, local government should be allowed also to have their own police, according to what LFI had just said. So, viewers, you have said it all. You have heard what the government have just said concerning restructuring in the country. Even if even if Brazil Mondo accept restructuring, then my question is, will this um, be, be done? Will this be persecuted? Will this be executed? Will they follow the laws and the rules? Or will they follow the uh, uh, decisions they have just made? That is the prayer we should be praying. And not believing or hoping on false, um, false hope. Having false hope. In Buhari, I don't you know that Buhari has made a lot of promises to Nigerians, and no, no of them has fulfilled. So we don't know if he's deceiving us yet or not until we see it ourselves. There's an added that says, saying is believing. So that is what we're waiting for right now. So let's see for ourselves. Actually, there's a multiple agreement to this. There's a, there's a difference between agreement and taking to practice. So, viewers, what is your take on this? Your comment concerning this news is very much important. Please don't hesitate to drop them below the comment box. Click on the subscription button as well as.